I've been very careful to monitor student response. So every, every semester I've, I've conducted anonymous surveys with the students. And I've generally found support. So the external students definitely like it. From the feedback we've had, um, they've been more engaged, they've been more interested, and the, the units themselves have provided more, um, I suppose, um, learning for them than in the past. Because they're not just sitting there passively taking in information. They've had to, they've been forced to be more um, active in their learning. So I, I think anecdotally, yes, it's been better for them. And I believe you can you can produce a much more polished performance in a, in a in a well I can anyway in a in a pre-recorded lecture than the umming and ahhing and, and forgetting where you were and distracted by the students and all those problems that that come with a live lecture. We've had really good feedback that they enjoy um, the online discussions because it's not just them discussing things with the convener or the online tutor, they're discussing things with each other. So we've had feedback that that's been much better than just the old format where they were just expected to listen to lectures and then um, submit assignments and that was it. It's a lot more um, interactive for the online students, so I think that's a benefit as well. The normal standard position is that the student has a choice of attending a live lecture or listening at home. What I've done is I've taken away one of those options. They, have to, they can only listen at home. And it's particularly interesting that a majority of students Active, actually preferred that situation, which I think was actually a response to the better quality of lecture that I think you can achieve. The flexibility that we've allowed, um, that it has been afforded to the students is probably the best one. But the idea of the flipped classroom, of course, is the idea that the time should be spent in the classroom problem solving rather than teaching, teaching information, you know, communicating information. And, and, and in law we tend to do that. The tutorials tend to be based Around, often around hypothetical questions. I can see it more obviously with the face-to-face -face students, but they're sitting there nodding their heads when other students are talking and when they're actually um, doing group work, they're, they're interested, you know, they're, they're sitting forward and, and talking to one another and they get up and do presentations and it, it does force them um, to get out of their comfort zone of sitting there as a, as a student just sitting listening to a lecture. They have to actually participate. So. To me, it, it seems like they're getting a lot more out of it.